And it just has all the tools. I think was humble from his uh, junior year. Uh, he thought he was going to have more success. We expected that out of him too. Uh, didn't come right away. Um, I think he's learned a whole lot from that. But we'll have to wait to see what happens on, on Saturday against Casper. Uh, you, 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 lack of experience. That's pretty much the, the main uh, word we could say. Uh, I think a lot of them have uh, some really good attributes. and uh, We have some speed guys. We have some route guys. We have some uh, you know, uh, possession type receivers. Um, so it's just a matter of them, again, learning what we're doing and uh, performing it to a high enough degree so we can put them in there and not have a, a mental mistake. Um, but yeah, I would expect you're going to see a, a whole lot of different guys rolling in and out until some guys step up and, and you know, declare that they're going to be the guy uh, that's going to be in the majority of the time. But we've got some good talent and uh, just have to see what happens with eyes, size and athletic ability. And you don't see too many guys his size and his athletic ability at this level. Um, can stretch a field vertically, uh, particularly you know, after 15 yards, he gets going. Not many people are going to be able to keep up with him. And just as big as he is, you have such a range to throw at him, um, where as other guys, you don't. But he's so long that he, he's got a big target all, all, all around him. And uh, he's pretty good at controlling his body and making the catches. So, um, again, he, he, he's still sort of inexperienced as well, missing that first half of the se uh, his season, his junior year. Uh, set him back some, um, so we're looking to him again be consistent with what we're asking him to do and go out there and perform. Uh, I, 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 hopefully Joe doesn't lose beat uh, from where he uh, left off last year. And it basically takes you know, your average freshman about six, seven weeks to learn what we're doing uh, enough and to a high enough degree where he can go out there and uh, perform without making any mistakes. And as soon as he did that, you saw him a whole lot more and you saw what he can do um, with the ball in his hand and he's a weapon. So hopefully uh, he picks up right where he uh, left off last year. Um, we do have some guys with some experience there. Uh, for the most part, we might or might not have you know just one new starter there. Uh, and that's, that's a position where you need as much experience as you can get live action in a game. And we took our lumps, I think, a little bit early on last year with those guys. And they started to figure out how to play college football, and uh, we became a, became a little bit better team. I, I think uh, we didn't live up to our expectations last year. Uh, I think we were all a little bit humbled by it, uh, coaching staff included. And uh, got to come out this year. I think that thus far this camp, we've really focused on those things that led uh, to our shortcomings last year, and we've done a good job uh, of raising the bar and our expectation level on certain things. And the kids have responded positively. They bought into it, and they're doing a good job. But again, the the test is that, is that first game against Catholic, we'll see.